Hi guys, it's Harvey from allpartspoolandspa.com. I've been watching some videos, YouTube videos, to, to me that turn very scary. Um, I'm going to ramble a little bit, but I'm, you really need to listen to this information. When you change out a pump or hire somebody to change a pump, be it a pool pack, a pool pump, a circuit breaker, GFI circuit breaker, 90% of the states in the United States require a electrical license. If it's not plug and play, where I'm talking about, you can actually unplug it and plug it back in. If you use a wire nut, use a screw, right, in back of a pump, and it needs to be hardwired, you need a electrical license. And also you need a permit. Okay? You can do these things if you're a homeowner by pulling a permit. And the reason why I'm hopping on this, there is a thing I don't I'm gonna have to talk to my insurance lady. It's either coming on the books or is already on the books this year. And you need to listen to this very carefully. Argument's sake, Joe Smo does a, let's pick a heat pump, pool heater, okay? Any type of electrical, but, you know, installs it, hey, you don't need a license. I, I charged it, you know, $125 for a GFI breaker, I'll do the wiring, da, da, da. I'll do everything for you, you know, for $6,000. All right. You saved a lot of money. But let me ask you a question. How much money did you save with this scenario? And it's coming on the books. You need to listen to this. It's either here or coming. Your insurance company. Let's give a worst case scenario. You have a heat pump, pool heater, any kind of major electrical work done. Okay, any major electrical work done. Some states, it doesn't matter if it's major or just a light switch. All right, let me give you a scenario. It is done four months ago. And somehow the insurance company gets the bill for the work that is being done. Well, they find out about it and they can prove it. And four months goes by, and your house gets hit by lightning. And it burns down to the ground, and it is proven it was done by lightning. Okay? Nothing the other guy did. Well, guess what? It's getting on the books, or going to be on the books. And you need to verify this. It happens state by state, insurance company by insurance companies. If the house gets hit by lightning and you didn't have a licensed electrician install something and have it inspected within six months, say I'm going to take the lightning strike hit four months after you had the work done, and the insurance company can prove the work got done. Guess what? Your homeowner's insurance is void. They don't have to pay for a dime. So if you think you saved two or three thousand dollars and this happens to happen to you, and you tell me how much money you actually saved. Now again, this is my opinion. State by state, insurance companies and by insurance companies vary. But you have to be aware, electrical and gas has to be done by a licensed electrician, a licensed gas person. And a permit needs to be pulled. Okay, The inspector is not responsible for anything, but a permit, and it has to be inspected, has to be done. All right, so argument's sake, we're replacing a pool pump. And the guy says, ah. Don't worry about it. It doesn't need to be bonded. Um, I can replace the, replace the pool pump. You don't need a permit. 
call your local inspector and before the work gets started and find out if it's true or not. You guys need to start protecting yourselves. Nasty things are going to start happening and people are going to start losing lives and it's going to get quite nasty. This is my a personal opinion, all right, opinion only, very state from state, but I believe in safety and keeping you guys safe. I'm Harvey, all parts pool and spa. I hope I didn't upset anybody. All I want to do is educate you. Take care of yourselves. Take care. Bye.